Okay, Ethan back again with the Anime Unboxing Club. I got the Otaku box in. So, feels a little small, but anyways. Don't forget to check out my wife's book, The Uninvited Guest, on Amazon. It's on ebook and paperback, as well as audiobook, either on Amazon or Audible or iTunes. So, there's that. Now, cue the intro. Okay, so let's get this thing started. Okay, first we have a calendar. Interesting. Well, it'll replace the the other one once it's <laughs> once it's done. Um, it's, it's technically December, so I mean. So let's see. Annual upgrade. We're going to upgrade your subscription to the annual plan and get so many goodies you won't believe it. See, that's what I did. And in fact, she put it on here. So here, upgrade. You can scan that QR code and upgrade to the annual plan. I personally won't get anything out of it that I know of, but you can still upgrade to the annual plan. If, if you have the money for that or whatever. So, so it's all the banners from January all the way through. Oh, so December's is Liz. Yep. Well, that doesn't make any sense. pretty good I like it um, like I said I can replace my old calendar because they give uh, they give you one of these in uh, every year uh, usually about the December box or there about but anyways anyway so the next thing I can't show you this if you're watching it on YouTube because it's something I could possibly get a copyright strike for however if you want to still see it check out Patreon because it will be on Patreon. I am not hiding anything from Patreon at all. Or editing things out of Patreon that that I can't show on YouTube. So, so the next thing, we have a coin. So, Liz has been doing these coins. Uh, they've been, they're really cool. I like them. Um, this one is of Albedo from Overlord. She's done, uh, this one actually has a, uh, a five on it. So she's done four other ones and I have them all. I am actually very happy about that, but I do have them all. So 2018 to 2022 in Anime We Trust Limited Edition. I wonder how many more of these she's going to come out with because I'm going to have to get get like a case for all of them. But anyways, there it is. Albedo in mint condition. That's really cool. 
I like that. I, I really do. I like that. That's really cool. Uh, she's had a number of different other wines. Uh, I think Raftalia was one of them, and Rias, and um, one or two others. But anyways, moving on. Here we have the shirt. I'm pretty sure this is the shirt. Also, pretty sure I'm gonna like it a lot. Well, ain't not a lot. But I am pretty sure I like it. Like the the material that she switched to, I really do like it a lot. Uh, it's made out of 100% cotton. Cotton. It says uh, the Otaku box, the only anime crate with scale figures, voting, and etchy. 100% cotton. And it says the size, but you guys don't need it. Not. Anyways. It says, look at this hottie. Um, I'm not sure what that's from, actually. So there you go. I like it. She looks good. And the shirt feels really cool. Like, literally cool, but <laughs> I like it. So, we have another legendary card. Like, uh, like I get every month, but still, a legendary card. Now, yeah, let's check out the banner. Ooh. Yep, I like that one. So I got a. So on the calendar. This is odd actually because December shows her, shows Liz, and November shows Rias in a. Uh, uh, like a Christmas costume, which I don't understand that one because it's November. But, anyways, so. October shows Rory from Mercury Gate, it looks like, which is what the banner, <laughs> the banner is, but I ordered the etchy version. So this is the banner. Very gorgeous. I like it. I like it a lot. That's one giant axe. I like it. I definitely like it. So moving on. So next we have the button. So the next thing would be the button. Which is of don't remember her name. Uh, it's it's the mermaid from Monster Monsume. Uh, I I forget her name, but there she is. Beautiful. I like it. I really do. I really like that one. Looks good. Um, next thing would be the card, which is of Blackheart. From, uh, waifu number 35 is Blackheart from uh, Hyper Dimension Neptuna. Whatever that is. But anyways, so there's the card. Which, by the way, 
if you are watching this on YouTube and you want to see it without the blur spots, check out Patreon because I am not blurring anything on Patreon. So check out Patreon. So next we have, I don't know what we have. This is odd. Oh, they're storage bags. I think they're storage bags. Yeah, there's okay, so they're storage bags. Uh, I've seen these before, or something similar to them. But you. Yeah, they're little storage bags. Like snack bags. They feel really good quality too and pretty strong. Like a, a, a thick kind of rubber plastic kind of material. Uh, and she did send three. Or they did send three. Which is cool because I have three girls. So uh, Amy will probably want that one for sure. Uh, and the other two, I guess, will fight over it because she didn't include pink. But anyways, yeah, that, that middle child, complete girly girl. So next we have... Anyway, so next we have... Ooh. She sent a set. I was only expecting to have, like, one... Or, uh, one set, but she sent two sets. These, she was, she had a deal that was, uh, stainless steel chopsticks for Black Friday. And so that's what these are. Stainless steel chopsticks. Uh, the one has the otaku box. 2022 and then Japanese writing and then the other one has the otaku box symbol and then it looks like the same Japanese writing and then it says TOB 2022 those are really cool looking and that would actually give me a reason to learn how to uh, use chopsticks like I think it's like that That's, those are really cool. I like them. So, yeah. The taco box. Stainless steel chopsticks. awesome that, that's awesome i didn't expect to get those actually i had seen them uh on the website a couple of times and thought oh those would be really cool to get but she sent them so she does not ever miss a beat when it comes to impressing so lastly we have the figure before we get to the uh the card or whatever you want to call it. So actually a lot of stuff in this box. A lot of stuff. Uh, at least one more item than normal. I think. Anyways. So let's open this figure up. Oh, cool. She she's uh, using like a thicker plastic that doesn't make as much noise. That's that's pretty cool. So when I took the this out of the box, the little metal peg fell out. Um, I 
There, now it's in. That was odd. Anyways. So now we put her... So, moving on. Or, so, let's put this together. There we go. So there's the figure. Uh, I forget her name. I also forget what show she's from. But, but there she is. Um, if you're wondering, her foot is up underneath. It's kicking out the dress. Well, it's supposed to be kicking out the dress right about there. So, yeah. Because I know it only shows one foot, but the other foot is under there. So. Looks good. Looks cute. So anyways, now on to the review. A lot. A lot for this one. Okay, so we have... Uh, the first thing was the uh, minifigure, which is the... Uh, it says soccer team. This anime, anime focuses on an elite uh, training regimen uh, called Blue Lock that will lead Japan to the FIFA World Cup. Grab some tasty food and enjoy. Now, I don't get the, uh, the minifigure because I ordered the, uh, the upgraded figure. So, but I'll be throwing a, a picture of that up on the screen now. So, the next thing is the uh, Taco Box collectible coin. Another great coin for your collection. I love showing my coins off to my Japanese friends. Their favorite is the one featuring me. What is your favorite? Oh, so Liz was on one of the, the coins. But anyways, so the coin would be right here. So there's the coin. It has Albedo from Overlord. And then... And then it has the Taco Box 2018, 2022, and Anime We Trust. I thought she was on a. I could have sworn it started before 2018. I don't know. Maybe she did, maybe she didn't. Uh, the next thing, it's the Otaku Box 2023 calendar, which it says another year means a full calendar of opus uh, for your enjoyment. All the artwork used on the voting form uh, is included in full color. Hope you love getting it a month earlier. So here's the calendar with the different... Uh, art winners throughout the uh, throughout the past year. Um, she already put Rius as the winner. It says uh, next month vote, and it shows uh, Rius, and it looks like um, I'm not sure who that is. But anyways. thing is the uh, the Otaku Box stainless steel chopsticks which are freaking awesome I, I love them to me they look pretty cool it says uh, I've been working on these unique chopsticks for quite a while I wanted them made from steel as I tend to drop them I am thrilled with the result 
Hope you love using them as much as I did making them. So that would be these chopsticks. Um, just an FYI, according to my friend at work, uh, who spent some time in that part of the world, uh, he has said that uh, stainless steel chopsticks are actually usually used in Korea, not in Japan or uh, China. So, just for your information. Next would be the add-ons, which is the shirt. It says schoolgirl t-shirt. <clears throat> says, oh my goodness, this is an adorable character. I can see why everyone loves her. Who can say uh, no to that smile and the plaid skirt? Um, the shirt's not plaid. The, or the skirt's not plaid. The, the skirt's uh, a plain blue. That doesn't make any sense. But anyways, so this is the shirt. I like it. They're always so soft and I love wearing them. So it'll definitely be going in laundry very soon so that I can wear it very soon. I really like that one and I like the, uh, the Neko Paro Neko Para one that uh, was a few months ago actually. Uh, I really like that one. That one was really cool. Uh, I'm not sure if I was if I showed that that unboxing because I think that was one of the ones where it had something in it that I can show without getting a copyright without possibly getting a copyright strike. Not that I would get one. So the next thing is a uh, Spirit Hunter upgraded figure, uh, which is the one that I usually get. Uh, it says replaces a minifigure. So it says one of the most beautiful spirits out there, but also the most dangerous. I don't understand this uh, spirit's joy in killing with her own hands either. It's a shame as her dress is adorable. Best be careful or she might eat you. Well. I've never seen that show. I've never seen this show at all, but it sounds interesting. Um, she's a beautiful character, uh, especially the way that they've uh, designed the, the figure. Um, it's the same design that they had for, I think it was a shirt. Might have been a shirt, but it was definitely a banner and I think a, uh, one of the waifu cards. So anyways, yeah. So the next stuff is, uh, the next thing would be the VIP item, which I cannot show you if you are on YouTube, because I might possibly get a copyright strike. Uh, and I refuse to post anything on YouTube that might get me a copyright strike. Or at the very least, I'm going to try not to post anything that might get me a copyright strike. So it says the next thing is the Otaku Box food storage bags. It says it's a free item. Uh, so that would be these. 
Uh, yellow, green, and blue. That's pretty cool. Uh, I'll definitely be getting some use out of those. So the next thing is actually the waifu card, number 35, um, but she has a misprint here that says number 34, even though it still has the correct name, which is Blackheart. Um, so here it is. There we go. So I'm using this uh, camera called, it's called a Logitech Brio. Um, I'm trying to figure out the, the auto adjust on it because uh, that way I can know how, how far away to hold stuff and stuff and you know, that kind of thing. So it's taking me a little bit to adjust to a new camera. So the next thing was the uh, Mermaid Girl button. I don't remember her name, but she's she's definitely from Monster Monsumi. But I don't remember her name. But anyways, it says, uh, So many famous monster girls in the world of anime, but can you tell who this lovely pink mermaid is? I'll give you a hint. She is nicknamed Tragedy Freak. Yeah, it is. It's the the... Mermaid Girl from uh, Monster Monsume. I think her name is uh, Lorelli? It, it's something like that. The button. Come on, autofocus. Oh, anyways. So there's the button. So, lastly, is the art winner. Um, so each month, we get to vote. Uh, the Otaku Box, uh, everybody that gets the Otaku Box gets to vote on which uh, anime art they prefer out of two of them. Uh, the runner-up becomes the button, which was uh, the mermaid girl. And then the winner becomes the banner, or the scroll, depending on what you want to call it, or how you want to call it. Um, says it's from Demigod. Says, almost a thousand years old and a demigod. This is someone I wouldn't want to meet in a dark alley. She enjoys bringing death to criminals with her scythe. Uh, she may look uh, 13, but she is someone to be feared. And that would be this. My problem with this one in particular is that it says that she may look 13. First off, a 13 year old doesn't have breasts like that. Or they might, I mean, uh, none of my girls are 13 yet. Um, but I think it's like they said in uh, a video by MXR Plays, which is uh, they justify making lollies look gorgeous or sexy by having them be like 
some kind of a demigod or demon possessed or something of that nature to where they're in all actuality like hundreds of years old even though they only look like a child I don't know if that's a good enough justification but So that was everything that was uh, in that was everything that was in the box. If you want to get the box for yourself, they, I'll be leaving a link in the description where you can get the box yourself. Uh, whenever you do, they will. Uh, whenever you use the link in the description, they'll take five bucks off your first box. I'm not sure how that works for me because uh, I pay for the year. But also, if you like the box. Or if you like the video, make sure to give me a nice big blue thumbs up. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And as always, please ding that bell icon to get notified every single time I make another video. Because so I do make them as often as I possibly can with the different boxes that I have. The Nihon, anime, or the Nihon box, the Anime Box Club, the Otaku box, and a number of different other ones that aren't monthly, but still. Anyways, also, if you want to see the things that I can't show on YouTube for the potential uh, strikes or uh, you want to see it uncensored, check out Patreon because I will not be censoring anything on Patreon. Also, if you do check out Patreon, uh, it helps out the channel. Uh, these, <laughs> these boxes are kind of expensive, but more than worth it most of the time to me. Um, but anyways, uh, if you would like to, so, uh, check out social media, check out the description because I'll be leaving links to all my social media accounts, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, Twitch, TikTok. Uh, I think that's all of them. Later. Stay safe. Stay awesome. See you later. In the meantime, check out my videos or my, uh, subscribe button over here or something. Laters.